The Manhattan High Indians looked to keep their season alive as they faced off against Wichita West in the second round of their 6A playoffs. Reporter Casey Campbell has more. Last Friday night, the 8-1 Manhattan High Indians faced off against the 6-3 Wichita West Pioneers in Manhattan. The Indians got off to a 22-0 lead to start off the contest before Wichita West scored a touchdown of their own to cut the lead to 22-6. This time of year, it's about surviving and advancing. Uh, you know, sometimes we, we didn't look pretty, but we got the job done. Uh, this is a special group of kids. Uh, I'm very pleased at how they've, they've went about accepting their roles and, uh, and uh, putting their egos on the shelf and just getting the job done. After the quick start from Manhattan, Wichita West began to get things going, going on a 12-0 run of their own. However, that run was very short-lived as Manhattan responded by taking the kickoff back for a touchdown of their own to extend their already big lead. One thing there where uh, Wichita West got some things going and off on the offense, uh, you know, we, we scored on the, the kick return and, and it was almost scoring too quick. We needed to, you know, we got to get back to ball control and uh, help our defense out and run the clock. It was here at Bishop Stadium where the Manhattan Indians beat the Wichita West Pioneers by a final score of 36 to 25. Senior running back Cavante McDonald was a big part, picking up 133 yards on the ground while also adding three touchdowns. We came out aggressive. We know it's a playoff, second round of playoffs, and we had to stay focused and throughout the game. And that's what we did, came out with the dub. With the win over the Pioneers, the Indians have a matchup next week with Lawrence Free State. Know what to expect, fast and physical. Free State got the crazy defense. I watched State film. It's going to be a tough game. Excited to play. Let's go. From Seco Park in Manhattan, I'm Casey Campbell, Channel 8 News.